You will need a can of spray paint, a dust sheet, a cloth, some fine sandpaper, overalls and a dust mask. Find an airy workspace or consider working outside. If you're inside, make sure you use lots of dust sheets. Overspray won't stick but it can travel a long way before it settles. Now we're all set up, we'll give the grill panel a thorough rub down. We're using 400 grit paper here, which is very fine. You can use a coarser grit, but don't go below 280. Using blocks or spacers prevents paint being smudged on the underside. Paint in long, even strokes. Keep the spray at about a 30 degree angle to the vertical. Step over in equal strips until you've covered the whole side, then repeat the same procedure, but from the opposite direction. To fully paint fretwork, we do four coats. Two in opposite directions on the first side, and two in opposite directions on the second side, but at right angles to the first side. By working this way, you will see it covers the edges of even the most complicated fretwork patterns. Now we'll flip it over and use the same principle to do the third and fourth coat. We did long ways on the first side, so if we do short ways this time, we know they will be at right angles. Finally, we just need to finish off some of the flat edges and sides. And then we're done. The grill panel is ready to drop into the cabinet. 